I'm going to show you guys how to get the best possible weapons from weapon shops in Cyberpunk 2077. First off, every weapon shop has its own unique weapons. So there's a shop for every legendary. This is a, this is the legendary sniper rifle shop. There's a legendary assault rifle legendary. I'll, I'll, and be sure to subscribe because I'll post a video for each one of those, where to find each one of those in the future. But this guy's legendary sniper rifle shop. And uh, there's a few things I want to talk about. The first thing is that there's two things you need to know about these weapons. Uh, there's two things that can change. First off, it's level. This is a level 17. It'll always be around your level, like plus or minus three levels or something like that. Uh, so you can always re-roll it until you get it close to your actual level. It'll be a little bit stronger. With every level, it costs more. And if you don't like, if you come back at level 30, it'll cost way more and it'll be way higher level. So you know you have to buy a new one every now and then if you want to keep it up to your level. Uh, but the other thing, and this is the most important thing, this is the main focus of this video, is that blue text. It says, power bullets can ricochet off surfaces. That's always the same. But the stats below that, all those stats, physical damage, crit damage, crit chance, all that, that can change. So if you don't like what you see there, you can just re-roll the weapon until you do see what you want. Uh, he wasn't always have it when you restock, so sometimes you want to restock more than once uh, to get another re-roll of it. But uh, yeah, they re-rolled it. And now, all those stats are totally different. It does chemical damage now instead of physical damage. There's crit damage, there's bonus ricochet damage, poison damage, and a 3.8 headshot multi or headshot damage multiplier. And it's like level 4, level, oh, it's probably level 12 now. But uh, I personally wouldn't want that one. But let's re-roll again and see what we get. If it even has it in stock. Okay, it doesn't always have it in stock, so you gotta like potentially re-roll multiple times. Okay, there it is again. Uh, now it does physical damage. Crit damage, bonus ricochet damage, bleed chance. Uh, and now it's like level like 10. Oof. Don't want that one. Let's skip again. Let's see about this time. Uh, super weak again. Uh, not that great. I'm just going to keep re-rolling it. And this is what you do. You just keep doing this until you find one that's closer to your actual level. So it's got the max possible stats. And then until you see stats that you actually like. Me personally, on a sniper rifle, I wouldn't get it no matter what, unless it has a 3.8 headshot damage multiplier, because the whole point of using a sniper rifle is to land those one-shot headshots. And if you get three, that extra 0.8 headshot multiplier is huge. If you can get that plus crit chance and crit damage, that's about all you really need. That plus having it be close to your level. So you just keep re-rolling. And I, I guess I don't need to sit here and keep showing you re-rolls, but that is all you got to do. That's how you get the best possible weapons from weapon shop. So any weapon that you get, if you find a place that has something you want, a legendary assault rifle, legendary sniper rifle, legendary pistol, whatever your favorite weapon type is, and you're like, oh man, I want that. Before you buy it, save the game and then re-roll a bunch of times until you find it with stats that you actually want. Uh, and make sure that it's actually close to your level so you don't get skimped on the amount of damage that it does. And if you need money to buy any of these, check out our infinite money cheat because there's a way to get 700,000 euro dollars per hour, which will get you you know anything you need although once you're like level max level buying this thing it'll probably be really expensive and you'll have to grind for like an hour to get a new one which will kind of suck but you know that's just how it is but yeah uh, i'm not going to keep re-rolling it you get the idea so you just keep doing that until you get one that you like and then just wait till you get a good one before you buy it that is that is how you get the best possible weapons from weapon shops in cyberpunk 2077 If this video helped you, consider helping us by subscribing to our channel. Tap this button over here and hit the red subscribe button. Subscriptions help a lot. Even if you never watch our videos again. Ha 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 ha!